What I am interested in in my music is to seek out the inner life of sounds. I, I tend to think about uh, material in a very uh, acoustical way, so disintegration of a motive or a sound or how it can be built up or how, how you layer things on one another. It's always been like my goal as a composer to make music that just reaches that point of intensity where when you're experiencing it, you just forget yourself completely. It's an exciting time to be a young composer in America, and developing the skills necessary to navigate today's musical frontier can be a challenge. For gifted young composers embarking on their professional careers, Copeland House's annual All Scholarship Cultivate workshops provide a nurturing creative environment. Composers selected are commissioned to write a new piece for the Music from Copeland House Ensemble. What I was looking, really looking forward to with this piece, um, I really stepped out of my comfort zone for it, and trying a lot of techniques and ideas that, things I was interested in but haven't had a chance to do yet, so I'm really excited since it's not all stuff that I'm 100% sure will work, so I'm really excited to work with the performers and see, you know, if it happens on the first try, great. If it doesn't, then I'm excited to figure out how to make that work. It's so often you... You write something, then you go in and you have a few intense rehearsals and then you're out. And having the opportunity to actually work with them on the piece and probably reshape it in some ways uh, to, uh, you know, you can sort of see your music in action. You can see like what its strong points and weak points are there and you can actually like tinker with it. So it's almost like a, it's kind of like a laboratory situation. Cultivate takes place on the picturesque grounds of Westchester County's Meerstead Estate in Mount Kisco, New York. Composer fellows are invited for a week in June, granted the luxury of time as they work closely with the ensemble and me, Derek Burmel, to revise and refine their musical ideas. At the end of the session, Music from Copeland House presents a concert of the new works for the general public, a rousing finale to a stimulating and productive week. The, the musicians have been extremely helpful. They're obviously really interested um, in kind of realizing your vision for your piece. You know, we're, the beginning of the week we start out, we're, we're just basically trying to put things together. We're, we're trying to survive together through the piece. And then uh, as we get more input from the composers, um, uh, they kind of direct us more about mood, about style, about what's important to them, um, things that may not be apparent to us on the page. Um, and it's really exciting. I, I'm just comparing how things sound at the beginning of the week to how they're, how they're developing now. It's, it's really, they've really come together in, in, in as very meaningful composition. The most piercing dissonances clash in a really atrocious harmony, and a few puny ideas only increase the disagreeable and deadening effect. And that was by uh, a, a new work by a man named Beethoven. This was written by one of the most illustrious critics in Vienna in 1806. We've been thrilled this week in having these young, uh, really gifted young composers take us on, on this journey. Derek and Michael are also fantastic. Um, I've actually known Derek for a long time. Our paths have crisscrossed before. Because he's a, uh, a performer himself, he has really great insight into you know small scale things like maybe if you just change this little thing, it'll make the whole thing more doable, or the, the music will come off will come off clearer to the to the listeners and to the performers. These are wonderful young composers, and and they've just had the opportunity to work with great professional performers, um, and and you know I've also been trying to add my little suggestions and hints in so that uh, so that you know it's a it's a coherent whole but hopefully also they'll have come away observing each other's practice uh, and and seeing how how everybody works and that's really part of the, this this the idea of this program to become a community and hopefully they'll also go away from this with new friends and colleagues uh, and really learning from the experience of their colleagues as well as their own experience.